Plot twist, turns out Shin is a sword that turned into this sentient being. How? I don't really know, but that's why when he was watering the flowers and the flowers were dying and Lena said, why don't you love, why don't you, you know, water with more love? It turns out he has no love. I actually feel so fucking bad for him. Why is he so funny though? It's just like this disconnect of emotionless face and him doing things objectively that just turns out so fucking hilarious now what is the heavenly father actually doing i have no clue my man just apparently wants to see the true demon king come out he's baiting anos for a good fight i got no clue but let's begin today's reaction can you just change the lena to leno <laughs> is it that big a deal i still have such a hard time understanding the rumors and the lures when it comes with spirits then it just becomes reality? So she must cease to exist for Lena to become Leno? I don't know, man. Oh, Lei versus Shin. Although technically this is Canon versus Shin. What is that? Why is the sword turning like that? <laughs> yeah, he can't. He's gonna kill the flowers again. Oh no! No! He just has no love! It's your fault for making the flowers, you know, only live if they're full of love. Mm. Oh. Oh, lay with the wingman advice? <laughs> oh, is it gonna work? Oh, it worked. Shit, good job. Good job. It worked, huh? Huh? Oh, he's not even caring about <laughs> He doesn't even give a fuck about her! He's just like, oh, you're, you're improving quite a lot. Really? I mean, I can't really tell, right? It just feels like the same lay, but... Alright. This is almost like a power-up for him then, huh? Dude, that sword keeps, like, glowing. What's going on? What? My ultimate technique. Oh? The time stop. Magic power disabled. It's a zone where no magic exists, and then, but shit. Don't kill him! I'm not exactly sure what happened there, but he just made all the magic disappear in that zone. He attacked. I don't know the significance of the attack, but we blocked it. Oh, still got you there. Yeah. Was her senses all wrong? What? Bladeless sword. What do you mean, bladeless sword? The blade does not exist in the present. What the fuck does that mean? It's slicing through the past. What the fuck does that mean? What? You're slashing through the past, so technically, even if you... Fucking, if you block it, it doesn't mean anything because that's the present. All the shit from the past can still happen. I... <laughs> Even if it did work, would it matter? It's kind of has fucking like seven sources. Hmm. That seems a little bit important. <laughs> Shin, come on, with more love, please. Shin, you might as well piss on the flowers, man. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, what do you got in there, Bleach? <laughs> Leno's just happy with this shit, he's like, oh great, great. <laughs> well, last time we scolded you, we felt so bad because he's incapable of feeling love. Will he understand that feeling though? Is he devoid of every emotion? I, I'm assuming he is. Yeah, if he was, the flowers wouldn't be dying. Oh, he feels... Oh, he looks kind of sad, man. But the flowers are just gonna keep dying. Mm -hmm. whoa, 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 whoa. Headless demon? Where is this coming from? Little side mission with Misha? Blaze Death King is someone that, uh... The Heavenly Father was trying to make us, like, side with last episode, right? Mm -hmm. Uh, that's kind of deep. I'm not sure if I'm following. <laughs> True. Only I am as strong as me. 
Goddess of Creation Militia. Wait, whoa, whoa, new characters. Holy shit, wait. Huh? This is completely new? Oh. Uh, okay. Important name to remember. Hmm. Oh, it's that kid again. That was looking for Anos in the intro scene, but... No clue, but royalty, apparently. So, because Hero Jirga did it, you're gonna beat this kid up? That's kind of fucked up. You can't just blame an entire, like, race after the actions of one person. Damn. Like, I know the humans were pieces of shit last season. Right now, it's no different for the demons. But, like, he's kind of right about that, too. Like, clearly, his anger isn't, you know, false. But at the same time, you should not be just stomping a fucking human child, bro. No, 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 no. It was not this kid, though. Anos, anyone? Bro, are we just gonna watch? Can't we do anything? Oh. So, fuck it, let's just let this kid suffer. I mean, if the outcome is the same, why not let this kid, you know, not suffer right now? Like, he's gonna suffer regardless at the end, so just spare him right- Wow. So, a child Anno shows up. They're just gonna- they're, they're about to get their asses whooped by a kid. Heal. Oh, this is gonna be good. Because we can exist, coexist. This addresses him by his name. How do you know me? Yeah, you, you're, you're, what are you doing with this poor child? You didn't do anything. Oh, oh. Is that illegal? Damn. Damn, talk your shit. It got way too real for him. Blink his eyes. What's gonna happen? Or just take the hit, sure. I wanted to see him like sigh or something and blow the magic away. You know, the classic Anos shit. Impossible! Our ultimate attacks! <laughs> oh, he's a little scuffed up though, just a bit. Bro, we don't need to. Oh, he's taking their anger. That's why he didn't block. What a benevolent king, even now. <laughs> he's like, I'll take all your anger right now. <laughs> They're justified. They're gonna get on their knees and start fucking crying. <laughs> My lord! <laughs> My lord, I'm sorry! <laughs> oh? Resurrect? Resurrect? I thought he might resurrect this kid, I don't know. Oh, really? I thought he might, like, say sorry, but... He tried to double down in front? Impossible! Those eyes! You should know by now. You should know by now, bro. You can't fuck with this kid. That's right, start crying. Get on your knees. Ask for forgiveness. Anoshu! That's right, sorry. We're not Anos, we're Anoshu. I just happen to look like your demon king. Bye now. Damn, he's actually crying. <laughs> what a benevolent king. Anos has such grace to him, man. Damn. I mean, it is true. Like, all the shit that the humans did to them. Doesn't mean you have to, you know, actually just curb stomp a child to do that, but I get what you're feeling. You are the demon king. Alright. Just wait 2,000 years, guys. Just, your suffering will end in 2,000 years. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Bye now. What a humbling experience, because usually Anos shows up and does this shit. But, like, he's in adult mode. So when a kid Anos does this, it's, like, even more exaggerated, because it's a kid doing it, you know? But who's this other human kid? Have we... Am I forgetting something important? What other character could this be that we already know? And what's going on up there? Some like shit's falling from the sky too. Like what was that? His reality shattering sword, right? Okay. So we get our OP sword back?
Order of Time, Revelon. Yeah, I'm not really following you, but okay, sure. Oh, he's back. Battle form. I, I lucked down on you. That was pretty cute, but okay, we're back. Mr. Mr. Who are you? What does the kid want, though? Uh, we need to go save them now? Damn, our king is back. This is actually true, even though it sounds ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, how could you not believe him? <laughs> I'd have to kill you once. To... <laughs> wait, 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 what? What do you fucking mean? I mean, I'm sure you can do this, but really he has to die once and then resurrect? Just die. Just die for me. <laughs> Something about Leno? Or never mind. That Abos is a fake? He's a phony? What's the rumor? What rumor are we planting from the past? What? I, I don't know. Like, Abos is a fucking phony? He's a fake or some shit? That's what I would imagine, but... Time to die. <laughs> <laughs> this is so fucked up. I know he's gonna resurrect, but like, you gotta. I need to tell you something. I need to kill you once, and then I'll resurrect you. <laughs> okay, I thought his head might get cut off or something, but you know, he just got Thanos snapped. But still, <laughs> what the fuck? Damn, everything from Militia. Yo, I think I'm not sure if it's just friends, but damn, I don't really respect and love Militia, huh? You want to just kill the gods for her? What is the restriction on Anos' resurrection? Like, he just can't resurrect these people again? Because all I remember from season one and onwards is that you know, could resurrect people immediately, but maybe there's like a condition. Damn. I didn't realize he actually carried this heavy of a weight. I don't know, it'd be nice if the sword started rattling and it has like a reaction like I hear you. Oh? Misha! Oh! That's, that's so nice! Now it doesn't look so, you know, depressing. You got cute flowers and stuff. Are they? All I see are inanimate objects, but we'll believe Misha. Because this probably makes Anos feel better. Look, there's a lot of glowy, glowy stuff. Maybe it's them. I never knew that Anos had such like a heavy weight that he was carrying. Another episode that kind of feels like setup, right? Because we're all leading to something that I'm not completely sure yet. This is not the pop-off episode. Now, what's going on in this one? Well, you know, Lei is apparently getting better. He's powering up, but then Shin also used this like bladeless move. That shit is ridiculous. He cut the past. What does that even mean? I don't know. It doesn't have to matter. Even if you block it, you're still going to get hurt. That's what that move is. And then there's Goddess Militia, who is kind of a new character. I don't think we've ever heard of her before. There's like such a close tie between Militia and Anos. Anos, you know, at the end, you saw the graveyard stuff, how he has such a, a burden that he's carrying that I actually never knew. I thought he was just a carefree guy that never really cared about stuff like that or had a heavy past, because no matter what, he'll just figure out a way to, you know, make shit work. So it's nice that Misha would put up like a flower bed of pretty flowers to say, hey, you know, they're listening. All your work is for good. Now, where are we going with this? I don't really know. I'm, I'm the best part of this episode, honestly, was killing that kid. Because it's like, all right, you got to I'm going I'm to kill you. I'll resurrect you. But I have to kill you first. The kid was like, yes, sir. This shit was so ridiculous. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.